Hey ladies, welcome back. Okay, so some of you have requested um, that I do some reviews on the lip stains that we have. The Unique Lip Stains. If I can get the labels to face out right. Um, these things are great. I love these things. I don't know why I didn't try them any sooner, but I'm so super glad that I did. Um, I will say one thing though. I have Skittish and Sultry. And this is Sultry. That one's Skittish. These are both super, super dark and pigmented. I love them, but they're not really for me. The one that I love is called Shy. I love, love, love this color. I love it for every day. I love it for um, church. I love it for work. I love this color, and I'm going to show you why. So it comes in a tube like this. You can see it's really, really full. I mean, that's right there where it stops. And here's where I was playing with some of the colors earlier. And they're not going anywhere. <laughs> Even the shine wipes, they won't take it out. It'll, it, it'll take some of the intensity out of it, but it won't take it completely off. So when it says lip stain, they mean it. It is not going anywhere. But okay, so anyway, back to what I was saying. I get so distracted. It comes in a big tube like this, and you take the top off, and it has this little doe foot applicator. This thing is great. It gives nice, even application. I love it. I can't say enough good things about this. So usually what I do, if I'm doing BB cream or foundation, I just kind of rub my finger over my lips first to make sure all that's off. I mean, not like, not super hard, but just kind of real quick like that because it'll kind of change the color of your product. I like the truest color that I can get. So I just kind of take the excess of that off. If you're in a hurry, you know, you're going to get the powder everywhere. You're going to get your BB cream everywhere. So I do that. And then I take a lip uh, pencil and I use Pouty with this one. And, oops, I'm gonna get a mix up. I go a little bit outside of the lines, turn it kind of on its side. And then fill it in and it kind of gives your, um, uh, your lip stain a barrier so it can't go any further. It's not runny but I don't know, this just seems to work for me. Put that on real quick. It is really, really cloudy today. I'm looking up at the window. Looks like it could rain at any minute. I don't know if we're gonna be able to do our errands today or not with the kids. I really don't like taking the kids out in the rain. Okay, so I've got that on. And then I go back in with Shy, just make sure I got the right color. Wouldn't that be a hoot? Go back in with that, and I get as much off as I can, um, just because I don't like a whole lot of color. I don't like a big, bold lip. Um, that's just me. And even color all the way around. I think I actually pulled off too much. Let's get a little bit more. Okay, and so once it's applied, let it dry. It's really, really quick. All right, so once it's dry, it's not going anywhere, I promise you. I'll even show you on my hand here. The little product like right there. The more I use this one, this color in particular, the more I like it. It's um, it's pretty sheer, and I like that. Here's the sultry. Check that out. It's beautiful. It's a beautiful color. It's just not really, um, it's not really my color. Do you know what I mean? Like you're you're comfortable with certain colors, certain colors you're just not. This is called skittish. Beautiful color. Okay, see if you can see those. Woo! All right, that one's skittish. That's sultry. And this one here on the end is shy. Let's let that dry a little bit, and I will show you how budge proof they are, okay? I can't even believe it. I mean, when they say stain, they mean it. Uh, and actually, there's a funny story with this skittish one. When it came in the mail, Ian found the package, my little boy. And um, I noticed that there was pink on the box, and I thought... 
that's really weird. Maybe, maybe it, you know, like, I don't know, maybe it leaked in the box or something. And so I forgot about it. A couple hours later, we were getting ready to go to bed. And uh, <laughs> Ian came in my room to talk to me. And I was looking at his hands, you know, and just kind of checking him over before he went to bed. And realized that on his hands, he had pink. Like, that color, pink. And I started to talk to him about it. I said, where did you get that? And he goes, and put his hands behind his back. So he actually had gotten into that, and not only was it on his fingers, his hands, it was right here on his nose, like bright pink, and he's pale as can be, up here on his nose where he had smelled it. And I don't know what it is with him, but he smells everything. The kid smells everything. And so t I tried to keep from laughing, but it was just so funny. And while I was telling him, well, you shouldn't mess up on me stuff because, you know, now it's called a stain for a reason. It's not going to come off. He cried. I was trying not to laugh. And for several days, he had bright pink on the end of his nose, on his fingers. It would not come off. So believe me when I say, it's a stain. All right, so this should be about dry now. I applied it pretty heavily. Okay. So anyway, there's my disclaimer for all you parents. Don't let your kids mess with your lip stain. Okay. All right, do you see this? Oops, that was already there. But you can hear how hard I am rubbing that. It, it's not going anywhere. It is not budging. Same thing on your lips. Not going anywhere. You're not going to be able to work it in. Once you get it on there, you're good to go. But that's kind of the thing too. This has no sheen to it whatsoever. It's just color. Okay? So once you get that on, I really do recommend picking up um, uh, either a lip bonbon or... Let's see if I can find something in here. I don't think I brought anything with me. Um, a gloss, Loyal is a clear. You just pop that on top of any of them, and it keeps the same color. You can layer different colors of gloss and uh, lipstick, and that'll give you a little bit more moisturizing um, uh, element to it because that is just color. But, I mean, for right now, that's really all I want. But I'm telling you, I absolutely love this color and I do not know why I didn't try it before. This is the lip stain again. Oops, upside down. And shy. You want to pick this up. If you like a, a really kind of neutral lip like I do, you want to pick it up. If you like hot pink, skittish is for you. So pretty. And if you like a darker color or if your skin's a little bit darker and you like a bolder lip, sultry. That color right here in the middle beautiful. They're all beautiful on. They all behave the same way. You're going to love them. I highly recommend this product. Thanks for watching. Bye.